The climatology plugin displays average global weather patterns, ocean currents, and cyclone tracks. The data and display is similar to the historic pilot charts, with higher resolution data and improvements. The intention is to determine sailing routes across oceans. The most important factors are wind, currents, and the ability to avoid tropical storms. To get started, I will enable the climatology plugin. To set the date to the current date, press the Now button. Wind is displayed in the standard Wind Atlas form. The length of the barbs indicates the frequency or likelihood of wind from each of the eight directions. If the frequency is 30% or greater, a number for that percentage is shown. The number of barbs indicates average wind strength from each direction. Each barb indicates 5 knots. The number in the center of the circle indicates percentage of calms if blue with less than 3 knots of wind or gale force in red with greater than 35 knots of sustained wind. Currents are typically displayed as arrows with an overlay map showing the strength of the current. As of 2018, the climatology current resolution is only 20 miles, so it is mostly useful for major ocean currents not close to land. The cyclone displays past tropical storm tracks. It might be interesting to note the variation in cyclone paths in different months. In the Philippines, the cyclones typically do not track as far south until later in the season because of the southwest monsoon. Unlike other oceans which typically have storm season for half the year, there are two distinct cyclone seasons in the North Indian Ocean between each monsoon and the storms travel in different courses in each one. From the configuration, it is possible to adjust the cyclone display with many parameters and note the wind speed key. It is also possible to display wind using arrows. This gives an overall impression of typical sailing routes. Currently, the plugin uses monthly data and interpolates between months to give daily values. There is also data for sea level pressure, air and sea temperature, cloud cover, precipitation, relative humidity, and lightning, which can all be displayed in highly configurable ways. It is possible to see yearly average by checking all. The data is derived from satellite measurements. All of the sources for where it was obtained is listed in the About tab. If you have any further questions, visit the Cruisers forum.